It's Nick's Psychotronic History of Sci-Fi. Ringworld is, well, the story of a giant ring surrounding a sun and the exploration thereof. It concerns a certain Louis Wu, a, a scientist who is roped into going to this mysterious ring with a crew of two aliens and a beautiful girl. Their spaceship crash lands on the ring and leaves them to explore its secrets. The story is getting back to more hard at science fiction, not having too much character development or a complex story, and instead focusing on the engineering of this giant ring and just what that would entail. Also, there was a tiger guy who wanted to eat people and an alien with three legs and two heads. It was, of course, followed by three sequels, as well as being tied in a known space universe, which would feature a long series of war novels that focused on the Man-Zen Wars, the species of the Tiger Guy. The idea of a giant terraformed ring would be used for the Halo series of video games, though these structures were based more on another scientist's designs for smaller rings that orbited their suns rather than encompassing them. This book made a star of Larry Niven, who would go on to write many, many sci-fi novels, often pairing with Jerry Pornelli to produce such works as Lucifer's Hammer, Football, and The Moat in God's Eye. There's really not too much to say about this one. I like Ringworld, I think it's a great sci-fi novel, and I highly recommend it, but, well, there's just not a lot to it. Check it out, it shouldn't give you too much trouble. Except for the math.